Hey everyone, how's it going? Aaron Rift here from NoDQ.com, as you can see on the lovely t-shirt, which you can get at ProWrestlingTees.com, search NoDQ. I am being joined by the West Coast professor, good old JM, Jeff Meacham. How's it going today, JM? And may I add, two-time Wrestling Trivia Challenge champion. That two is time, true. Multi-time. Multi -time. Multiple-time trivia extraordinaire. There you go. I like that. That works for me. And today, Jeff knows so much about the history of our great... Sport, professional wrestling, the sports business. entertainment, whatever business. you want to call it. Dusty would say. He's here to help me talk about the 2017 NoDQ.com Hall of Fame. Last year was the very first class. We had several top names go in. This year we have a lot of top names going in, but only one person from each category can... Or one group. Or yes, one, group. one person or one tag team or faction can get in per category, so... Our job here today is to help you guys decide who you will vote for. So Jeff, let's go ahead and break down these categories. We will give our thoughts. First up, we have the 2007 Male Superstar of the Year. The nominations are Steve Austin, AJ Styles, which is interesting, Shawn Michaels, Hulk Hogan, Ric Flair, and The Rock. So Jeff... Your thoughts? Well, I mean, w when you look back in 2017, Aaron, honestly, it, it's it, it, this is this is a good category. I like this one already. However, I, I'm not sure if I'm ready to make Hulk Hogan the first two-time No DQ Hall of Famer. Ric Flair has it in the WWE, but he doesn't have any in the No DQ category yet. So I'd say all-time male superstar for this year. The Undertaker won it last year. Right. Why not have one of the guys that fell to the streak? The Nature Boy, Ric Flair. That is very interesting. That's a great choice right there. I mean, they're all great choices. AJ Styles, I think it's too soon, and I do not think AJ should be inducted ahead of some of the all-time great legends. Pretty much most of these guys on this list, actually. Exactly. AJ is great. And I, we, we, we've had AJ Styles going back more than 10 years. But AJ Styles has not been you know, around as long as Shawn Michaels, Steve Austin, Hulk Hogan, Ric Flair, or even The Rock. So I think give him more time to build his legacy, more than he already has, or the legacy he already has. Now, honestly, the legacy he has now is worthy of Hall of Fame induction, but he's still, you know, not with these guys yet. I totally agree on that. I think it's too soon for AJ Styles. Yet people, and people they nominate him. It is what it is. People like the guy that much that they want him in the NoDQ.com You can't Hall of Fame. help but love AJ Styles. This he, is he, the People's Hall of Fame after it, all. It is People's Hall of Fame. And ultimately, so, well, the People's Hall of Fame, why not be The Rock then? Great point. The Rock is definitely... Is the People's Champion. He always has been. He always will be, well, despite the claims of some others. Yeah. Um, I love Dallas, but it's, it's a true story. Um, I have to go with... I have to go with Steve Austin because okay. I, I would say... I'm torn between Hulk Hogan and Steve Austin. I don't think the fans are going to vote Hulk Hogan in. It might be years before Hogan gets in, unfortunately. I, agree I think he should be right at the top. But I, I think it's going to be Steve Austin. And I, I will go ahead and say Steve Austin, considering his run in WWE and arguably the biggest name of all time in Wait, sports entertainment. Yeah, I remember, when you started covering this great business of ours was 1998, correct? Right. Who Austin, was the biggest star at the time? Austin Stone was Cold right Steve on top. Austin, he, was right, he was literally, you know... Two-time WWE champion by the time the website started, so you know it's just a matter of you know, semantics, really, because you know Austin was the guy when you started. So I'm not yeah. surprised you voted for him at all. I think your dog would want Rick Steiner to be in the Hall of Fame. Dog face gremlin would I, I would assume that very much so. But we're gonna go where well, you're going with. I'm going with H. You're sticking with Ric Flair. I'm going with Steve Austin. But it's up to you guys to decide. <laughs> 